Hello and welcome to today's September 10th second stimulus check and second stimulus package update. I have some good news for you today and want to go over that with you. If you're a subscribed member of my community, hey, welcome back. I sure love having you in my community. Okay, now the 78 page skinny bill that most of us hated has just been blocked in the Senate. It did not get enough votes to move forward as a bill. Uh, this means that the Senate will now need to debate the bill or scrap it and start over. I'm not sure which one they'll do because this is breaking news. Okay, it looks like 52 of the 53 Republicans voted in favor. One did not. And all of the Democrats in the Senate voted to block this skinny bill. I can't even remember the name of the bill. That's how much I disliked it. Uh, the new bill would have gotten unemployment for 29 million workers uh, money through the end of the year, money to school, and about $10 billion to the post office. Uh, but this bill said nothing about stimulus checks to the rest of us and nothing about money to the states, which they need, right? So the bill, uh, although it was not dead on arrival, was said to have been going nowhere, which if you look up in the thesaurus is just another way of saying dead on arrival. <laughs> in a surprising twist, uh, Senator Chuck Schumer of New York said this skinny bill will actually set the stage for the bigger bill that we want. McConnell said he doubts Democrats want to see another deal. Uh, while Schumer said he is optimistic that under pressure, Republicans and President Trump will compromise. Steve Mnuchin of the Treasury said in a recent interview that he and President Trump would like to see more stimulus for the American people. Again, Senate Minority Leader Chuck Schumer predicts that new, a new Republican bill will not go over well uh, and that they will have to come back to the negotiating table with bigger numbers. Uh, he continued by saying there's a good chance they feel pressure uh, once they see that the Democrats are not going to fold to their emaci emaciated bill, which leaves so much out. The pressure will mount on them. Our bill meets the needs of the American people. Their bill meets the needs of a few ideolog ideologies uh, who don't want to vote for anything but they feel pressure from the public. Uh, Schumer, I think, is right. I, I think that they went too small. Now, remember in May, the Democrats went too big, and now in September, the Republicans have gone too small. Can they please just meet in the middle and get this done? Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, McConnell has publicly said that Democrats don't want money to reach the American people, to which Democrats said, uh, we do want money to reach, but we want more than what you are willing to give. So, hey, if you found this video helpful up to this point, will you do me a favor and give it a like? I really appreciate that. That's how YouTube knows whether to share my videos or not. And please share this on Facebook and social media. People need to know that this skinny bill was blocked. Okay, now, <laughs> President Trump is getting tired of this back and forth lack of momentum from Congress. And he is saying that he is right on the verge of issuing an executive order that would take $260 billion from the original CARES Act and redirect that as money to the people, these direct stimulus checks to the people. Politicians wouldn't have to fight over budget. They wouldn't have to try to make each other look bad. This money could start going out within one week of the executive order. So I'm hoping that he will do this, but he has also said that this should come from Congress and Congress should work together. Uh, but from what you guys have seen, as I've been doing this now for almost six months, th these guys don't come together. It, they just fight. Okay, um, now uh, the other thing that I'm hearing is that uh, President Trump is becoming disgusted with the Congress 
And he is saying that he is also considering an executive order that would extend unemployment as the FEMA money is set to run out within the next three to five weeks. So we could see more executive orders uh, with President Trump getting it done. Now, uh, I know some people on this channel really, really like Trump and some really, really hate him. Um, but uh, those that are receiving unemployment right now or are being protected from eviction or don't have to make payments on their student loan debt, uh, that all came from President Trump's executive orders. And so those did, those did have an effect. They weren't perfect. Uh, but it looks like there may need to be more executive orders in order to get money out to those that uh, have been promised a second stimulus check and also the 29 million Americans that are still out of work. So as I have more information, I'll definitely share it. But that, that's the, the news uh, as of today. Uh, I just want to thank you for being in my community and remind you that you are amazing. I'll see you on the next video.